there, folks. Kevin Carroll here with your PM update, looking ahead to Sunday's edition of the Times Leader. It was a strong run this season for the Dallas baseball team, but that season came to an end today with a 7-1 loss to Belfont in the PIAA Class 4A championship game out of Penn State. John Erzar was there. He'll have all the details for you. Luzerne County is launching a new program that will allow income-eligible homeowners to seek funds to preserve their aging homes. Jennifer Hernandez will explain. I was over at the Wilkes-Barre Juneteenth celebration today on Cole Street. Watch for my story as well as some drone footage from our very own leader, one. Roger Dupuy takes a look at a new Misericordia University art exhibit focusing on railroad photography in the region, which also features a very large moving component designed to delight visitors both young and old. And Bill O'Boy will pay tribute to his dad and all dads this Father's Day in his Beyond the Byline column. All this and more in Sunday's Times Leader. And remember, folks, if you're not already a Times Leader subscriber, all you have to do is call 829-5000 or visit timesleader.com slash subscribe. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day.